What's going on everybody? It's Ryan from Best Face Forward. And in this video, I wanna answer, help to answer a question that I get asked pretty often, which is what do I do if my tongue doesn't fit on my palate? People will either say my palate is too small and I can't fit my tongue up there, or my tongue is too big and it feels like it can't fit up on my palate and they may think that they need to get an appliance or some kind of expansion in order to do mewing. In this video, I wanna tell you why that's not necessarily the case. And I have Dr. Shia Faragella from a recent interview that I did with him who's going to talk more on that. If there's any scalloping on the side of the tongue, that, that can sometimes mean that the tongue's hanging down a little bit low or it, it kind of goes up in the middle and then hangs over the back teeth. You see what I mean? So it's up. But, but then you might say, well, well, there's not enough space there. And that could be true. And it's sometimes very hard to fit it in. And sometimes you need to get expansion. But sometimes it's just, it's just a matter of um, being able to make sure that the tongue, uh, the back fits up there and forcing it back and up and squeezing it up there. And with time, the tongue gets to a point where it strengthens. And as it gets strengthened, you lose a bit of fat there and it can get a bit smaller. So it goes from being this almost long flabby thing to having a little bit of, of yeah. moss tone to it. Right. Mm -hmm. I look at my photos. Like I, you know, Dr. Zaggy, Dr. Saruj Zaggy yeah. and yeah, yeah, Breathe yeah. Institute. Mm -hmm. I did a consult with him about a year apart and he screenshotted my tongue in the first one and the second one. All oh, right. And, yeah. and he could, he said, I can tell you've been doing the, the Mayo. Just yeah. because before my tongue was like this flabby thing and now right. it, it, it had it had more like shape to it. So yeah. that's what I sometimes tell people because, you know, people think, oh, I have a small palate. My tongue doesn't fit. Well, maybe you can get your tongue to fit without yeah. necessarily expanding your palate. I, I mean, it's possible, that's, right? That's very possible. It's very possible. So, I mean, with practice, um, you can definitely do it. So I recently spoke to a great dentist in Toronto who gave me a really good analogy on this, which is the following. You can sort of think of it like an elephant trying to fit into a doghouse in some circumstances, where if your palate is really narrow and small and high vaulted, then it can be almost impossible to actually fit your tongue up there without some expansion or some assistance from a dentist. However, that's not always the case because in this circumstance, the elephant can actually change shape. So your tongue can actually get smaller over time. As you practice and do myofunctional therapy and mewing, your tongue can become more narrow and more toned. So it's actually the elephant can get smaller and make it easier to fit in the doghouse. And as it does that, the doghouse, which is your palate, we know can expand if you can get your whole tongue up there. Another thing is you can learn, your tongue can learn the ideal resting posture by doing the right exercises. So right now your tongue may be resting low in your mouth. And if you can do exercises to stretch your tongue, to strengthen your tongue, to practice the passive lingual suction, where your tongue is just suctioned up on your palate, you can improve your tongue's ability to fit in that doghouse or in that palate. So is it possible that you can get your tongue to fit on your palate if it doesn't right now? Absolutely, 100%, that is what I believe. And you may need some help or some expansion. It's obviously impossible for me to tell, just speaking behind a camera right now. The, the, in this video, this is just the opinions of myself and the other professionals who I've spoken about. I recommend you go see a dentist if you want a more individualized opinion. For I'm hoping that this video can give you guys some hope that it is possible to see results just from mewing because your tongue is a very powerful muscle and our bodies are always adapting and changing. So thank you for watching this video. Please leave a comment and let me know what you think and subscribe if you haven't already. We also have our free course to help you maximize your tongue posture, where we'll show you some exercises that you can use to begin to improve. So go to the link in the description to sign up for that and get on our email list where you'll get a lot of great information as well. Thank you guys for watching and I hope that this video can help you to become the best version of yourself and we'll see you in the next video.